Welcome, wait, welcome to the J.R. Hendrick Texan Gentleman, a podcast that deals with the early life of J.R. Hendrick. And now, here is an episode with J.R.'s father on the Andrew House Show. Administrators for Public Liaison and Small Business Administrator, James Ryan Hendrick. Jim, how are you? <laughs> Having the time of my life. I hear you're doing a, a, a vacation in Fairfield, Virginia with Scotty Underwood. I am. What do you think of the climate going on in Washington? Well, if you ask me, a lot of the uh, inactivity... Uh, some members of Congress are trying to expand uh, Medicare spending, which I think should only be allowed with limitations, but it's been killed in the House. Um, so far, vote on sustainability with small business and access of education has been tabled until sometime this fall. And meanwhile, uh, Bill Clinton is off playing footsie and, and, uh, and politics. As far as I know, yes, sir. Uh, <laughs> he's, he's staying away from the limelight and a lot of some information. Uh, yes, uh, from what I hear, Justin Bell, he's, um, He's wanting to deal with uh, the issue. Um, there's a guy named Wayne Leland who is on um, the state of Arkansas's deal with the racketeering, uh, bribery rather, and Justin Bell trying to save face. He was a investor, investor involved in, in Whitewater. Yeah, it's like I'm thinking, you know. The, the ball's dropping like it should. And uh, I think in a couple of days I'll be back in office and uh, working my heart out. Do you think Clinton will send you on another tour in hopes of maybe shutting you up? Uh, he thinks he can try. I'm, and I'm probably going to get my marching orders sooner or later. Um, but regardless, um, my wife and I are leaving for Baton Rouge um, on the 28th regardless. So if he sends me somewhere before then, we'll, we'll stay there until until we leave for Baton Rouge and then we do that. <sighs> well, all right then. Have Let me ask you this. Have you heard anything else about the, the effects of Congress? Uh, like I said, um, I admire New Gingrich, but I know that some moderate Republicans are trying to move this thing slow as molasses when it comes to aid to small business, along with some Democrats. And it's sad. It's it's sad. And you would much rather see some changes coming here and and quickly. Well, they have to. I developed a plan back in December that has that has been uh, in the works, and so far. <sighs> Clinton administration and Congress has not approved one thing that I have recommended. 
And so, to that end, to be honest with you, Andrew, I think everybody's just trying to save face. You say that, and I say that. Um, now, however, I think I think Gingrich is doing what he can to slash spending. Spending needs to be slashed in some areas where there's some overgrowth. And where is the overgrowth? Where is the red tape? Social Security, Medicare, and Medicaid. But if you hear the mainstream media, <laughs> you're, uh, they think that we're cutting people's benefits. We're not cutting people's benefits. We're cutting how much these bureaucrats can, can, can get the hands tied in D.C. And, and make a deeper problem. That's, that's the issue here. And to that end, I think, to be honest with you, the American people have had enough. So you think Clinton is on his way out. Well, if he ain't on his way out, it's my hope that some of his cronies are on the way out. Now, Webster Hubble, I'll be honest with you. I didn't see it coming. Now, there's some people who said he didn't want to serve under Clinton. I'm not sure I even believe that. <laughs> Someone spreads lies like that, it's probably going to be uh, a Hillary, I guess. Which means, in some ways, you still don't trust the, the Clinton administration. I don't trust, but I do what I can. All right? I just I just speak my mind, and that's how it is. All right, thank you, Jim. We'll get back with your calls. Stay tuned, guys, because the best... Of the uh, second hour of Anger House is underway. Hope you enjoyed listening to the J.R. Hendrick Texan gentlemen. If you like what you hear, please subscribe and become a part of the adventure. This is the James Hendrick Empowerment Network saying until next time, get ready for the rest of the story. It gets more interesting from here.